You have big goals and high standards for your life, but that doesn't mean you're gonna wake up with the determination to meet your full potential every single day. So when you lack motivation, these 20 facts will bring you back to where you need to be so that you can finally get to where you've dreamed of being. Welcome back to my channel, guys. This video is actually a continuation of a video to watch when you're sad. You guys love that video so much, so I thought I would make this into a series. And right before we get into the video, remember that I have my podcast and my second YouTube channel linked below in the description so make sure you check it out and this video has kindly been brought to you by Bean. As the new year is approaching I always like to set my goals a few months before the new year approaches that way they're already habits by January. Right now I've been aiming to wake up at 6 a.m. every single day and go to bed at 10 p.m. every single day and let me tell you it's kind of hard especially when my goal with waking up at 6 a.m. is to hit gym first thing in the morning okay and I just don't have the energy every single morning but beams dream powder has saved me with this beams dream powder is a healthy hot cocoa formulated to help you get your best night's sleep no matter your lifestyle dream powders come in a range of customizations from different ingredient stacks to stronger potencies to a variety of flavors and this makes the experience of sleep easier healthier and more enjoyable achieving proper sleep gives you the right energy proper focus Focus, improved mood and reduced stress and all of the ingredients in beans dream powder helps you achieve just that it includes reishi magnesium l-theanine and melatonin all of which will help improve the body's sleep cycle manage stress it will aid the body's ability to fall asleep and promote better sleeping quality my favorite benefit of this powder is it makes sure that you wake up the next day with no more grogginess in the morning and let me tell you this drink basically just tastes like your regular hot chocolate but with no added sugar and it's only 15 calories so you're treating your sweet tooth while getting a better sleep and remaining healthy so you can join me on the journey to a better night's sleep by clicking the link below in the description and by clicking that link and subscribing you can save 20 percent on beebs dream powder you can get an additional 15% off and a free frother when you click the link below. You can pause, skip or cancel at any time so there's no risk. Okay, let's jump into the video and get motivated. One, what if it goes better than you could have ever imagined? What if you're not even ready for how good your life is about to get and all of the little things that you're stressing about don't actually happen? Every single scenario you've thought about your future lifestyle, every single picture you saved on Pinterest for your vision board, every single one comes true. I want you to close your eyes and place yourself in the reality where you actually get every single thing you want. That dream version of yourself that you can only hope to become one day, yeah, that version of you already exists. And that dream was planted within you for a reason. Because our reality that we live out on a daily basis is simply a reflection of our own perceptions and beliefs. And that's why everybody else experiences life in their own different, unique way. The life that you are currently living is a projection of your own thoughts. So if you are already thinking about that dream reality, if you are able to conjure up a vision of your wildest dreams and you living them out, it will also come true. Like think about it, remember five years ago when you wished for what you currently have, you ended up getting it, right? And that pattern is just gonna keep on, keep on repeating throughout your entire life. Three, imagine there is a book or a film or a documentary being filmed about your journey to success. Imagine there's a filming crew following you around right now with a bunch of cameras and microphones makes you want to get up right so while you are laying around in bed not wanting to get up because your perfectionism is holding you back fearing that pile of work on your desk because what if i fail what kind of journey to success is that if everybody knew and it was guaranteed that you were going to succeed and people wanted to film your journey to the top how would you live life every single day four you will never regret going to the gym you will never regret working for another hour you will never regret waking up early to study extra hard but you will regret refraining from doing any of the above simply because you felt too lazy. Five, there are people out in the world who have fewer resources, lower IQ and less talent who are still making bigger moves than you simply because they have the audacity, the confidence, the courage to go out and just try. You should be at the top of the game right now. You have more skill than majority of them put together but you're not because you're holding yourself back from being a perfectionist. Six, I bet you look back on the past and wish things had gone differently. You had worked harder, you had acted better. You can't control or change any of that, but you can control what your future self is thinking about what you're doing right now. It is your responsibility to make sure that your future self isn't regretting how you spent today a year from now. If you have grown at all as a person, then even the thought of your past self should be giving you the ache right now, right? Well, think about it. Yourself in five years is laughing at you right now. 
they're talking shit about you. Oh, they're so lazy. They didn't do X, Y, and Z. They couldn't even work hard. Your future self has regrets about you. Prove them wrong today. Seven, thinking about your goal, researching your goal, planning your goal, talking about your goal to other people is not you taking any steps to actually achieve your goal. When are you really gonna start? Because the longer you talk about it and plan it and research it and schedule it, other people are actually out there doing it. Eight, embarrassment is the test. Embarrassment is how success filters out who is actually worthy to reach the top. Some people are so concerned with validation that they just throw away who they actually could have been. So when you accept failure and judgment and embarrassment simply as a way of life and just another step to your journey to success, you instantly outdo the 99%. Nine, everything that consumes you today can simply be a blurred memory if you play your cards right. When you work hard at your goals, instead of dwelling on all of the people that put you down, did you wrong, rejected you, you eventually reach a point that no one else ever thought you could reach. All while looking back, laughing, and trying to remember why you were so upset about them in the first place. You outdid them. Other opinions can't get to you once you move on to the next level. Their words can't reach you up there. All of those people you're so concerned about today won't be in your league tomorrow. 11. You know what's motivating? When you think about all of the people, places, charities, businesses, causes that you are going to help once you make it in life. You are going to be the change that you crave to see in the world. You have the power, potential and ability to inject so much goodness and opportunity into the world, not just for yourself and your loved ones, but for people everywhere. And you give up that potential reality every single time you decide it's too hard. It's too tiring. Twelve. You have to stop making decisions based on your current life experience and instead start pursuing the goals and routines of your ideal self. It's the only way you'll actually become them. Your past has no business here. It didn't get you to where you wanted to be, so why are you still focusing on it? Nothing changes if nothing changes. You have to take a different route. In order to get something different, you have to completely shift what you've been doing so far. Would your most successful self be complaining all day? Asking for a break? Wishing they didn't have to work? No. So why are you? 13. The harder your journey, the stronger you will become. Every time you struggle because of fear or a lack of knowledge, remember that challenge is simply another step in preparing you to become the person of your dreams. Adversities are a gift. Everyone out here has got it so easy with their simple routines and their holidays and their breaks. They are never gonna reach the heights that you do. Failures only bring lessons. Failures are only here to redirect you onto the correct path. Other people are out here trying to chase the easy life and avoiding failure, so they'll never learn the lessons that you will. You are gonna have knowledge that no one else could even reach because they're not taking the steps to reach them. So next time everything gets hard, remember it's life preparing you for the life that you prayed for. 14, when you wake up in the morning and everything feels too hard and you're too tired to want to leave your bed, you get up and you do it anyway. Whether it feels tiring or difficult shouldn't even matter. It's just a feeling. Are you really gonna let a temporary emotion dictate whether you go to bed that night feeling good about what you accomplished or not? Are you really gonna let your mood control what your life ends up looking like? No. So get disciplined and start prioritizing logic over emotion. That is what separates you from majority of people. 15. You are literally all that. You have clear goals. You don't accept a life that you do not deserve. You wake up early. You work harder than most. You fight to become the best version of yourself. You search for motivational videos online. Do you know how rare it is to have that vision and discipline? You become untouchable when you throw in consistency with that entire mix. Imagine how powerful and successful you will become just from that simple routine. 16. You are not the only person working at your dream. There are hundreds of thousands of people across the world working to get exactly what you want. When you go to bed, they stay up an extra hour working on their craft. They get up earlier than you. They go harder in the gym. They don't get distracted when they're putting in the hours. They're going to all the networking events. They're studying how to execute their dream perfectly. So what are you doing to beat them? Because obsession is gonna beat talent every single time. 17, the success and the results that you are so desperately looking for is in all of the work that you're avoiding. Your life is so long. So imagine that you did things differently and played it a little bit risky for six months. That's it, half a year out of your entire life. 
you went out and did things you didn't normally do, you changed up your routine, you spoke to people you wouldn't normally do, you completely got out of your comfort zone. If it all went wrong, it wouldn't even matter. It's six months of your life. But if it all went right, it has the power to change the trajectory of your entire life forever. 18. Just because you're going through a bad time right now doesn't mean you're not gonna get a great ending. Just because things are slow and nothing's moving and it's failure after failure does not define how your entire life is going to go. It doesn't mean that one day you're not gonna look back and laugh at the fact at how everything was going so wrong but you didn't give up because you were always going to get exactly what you knew you were meant to receive. 19. You messed up this week? You didn't get anything done? Go again tomorrow. Get up again tomorrow. One good day can have a tremendous effect on all of the days that follow after that. So tomorrow, wake up early, go to the gym, work harder, put in more hours, cut out all of the stupid distractions. That's the magic formula. That's only like five things to do. Repeat that formula every single day and that is exactly how you win. When it's that easy, what's really your excuse? And finally, 20. Remember who the fuck you are. What do you mean you're sat there wanting to give up? Oh, it's too hard and so and so treated me this way. Who gives a fuck? You are the shit. Every single hurdle and obstacle life decided to throw at you, you fought through it. And guess what? You're still here standing today. So if you can get through all of that, why are you still carrying the burden of all of this has happened to me all throughout life? Remember who the fuck you are. You are capable of so much more you give yourself credit for and you do yourself such a disservice when you compare yourself to others. When you get too much about thinking all the time rather than doing all the time. Once you realize how much you're capable of and how much you deserve your wildest dreams, it will flow to you. You will then get up every single day and fight for it. And that brings us to the end of this video. I know this was a shorter one, but I hope it gave you your daily dose of motivation. I hope it has given you a kick up the butt and you are gonna go today and make today great. I want you to wake up first thing every single morning and wonder how can I become 1% better? How can I make this day better than yesterday? How can I outdo and beat and give myself the ick of who I was yesterday because I conquered today? I wanna see you win. I want you to send me messages on Instagram in six months telling me that you won got this. I believe in you. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you and I will see you in the next one. Bye.